All right, so what we're working on today is we have the sensor for our depth finder chart plotter. We're going to be mounting it here, but up here was where an old wire came through, and we're going to use that same hole. Unfortunately, with this, this end doesn't come off, so we have to have a hole. This kind of sucks. We have to have a hole big enough for this end to go through. It's pretty close, but not quite, so we're going to try to drill it out just a little bit. See how that goes? I don't know. Okay, so actually that wasn't too bad at all. We still We still got room, so that's good. What I'm going to do, I've got marine sealant, and we're going to pump these holes full before we put any kind of screw in it. This is 3M and it's not worth a crap. Maybe the product is, but the case sure as heck ain't. So continuing our mess. silicone every freaking place so the first thing we're gonna do is take this zip tire around this post here and drop it you got to pull this tight and tighten that down come behind our harness here
Okay, now we're in here in the bedroom. And we found our our thing. See, we're in the back of the bedroom. That panel drops down. I'm kind of glad I cut that glove box in there. We're getting pretty freaking close on the length. Oh, hey, but we made it. We're gonna make it eventually. As I'm pulling it, it's pulling it back. Let's see if we got it. We got it. Well, we got it through there. And since there's already a hole here, we're just gonna shove it right up through there for now. That was crazy. So now we got that thing running on all the way. Good deal. Now we can put our glove box back in. So yeah, I'm really glad I uh, put that glove box in there now. How do I lose the screw doing that? I don't understand. So now I gotta find some power. So we got power on that. So the yellow on this is automatic on. We don't want that. I have to get this one right because this is the last connector of this type that I have. The yellow is a constant on, which means if this is connected to any kind of power, like as soon as you turn the key on, it automatically comes on. We don't want that. We want to turn it on and off. So we're going to connect a red and a black. The blue is, uh, I believe, an alarm. And we got to figure out how to, how to do the ground here. Let me see if this is working. It's got power. So it's got power. Unfortunately, these stupid dashes on these bay liners there isn't room for crap. So I had to order a special mount to mount this. So we have to wait for that before we can finish installing it. But we got the wires running and we got power. So that's a good thing. So now I'm gonna somehow get this thing back in. thing just doesn't seem to want to go anyway I don't understand it I don't know where that screw goes in from I guess in the bathroom maybe but I can't Get this thing back in here like that, I know. Man, even 
bear. I just can't get this thing in here. This is freaking crazy. Any which way you turn it, I can't get this stupid thing in here. You would think if you could put that corner all the way in there. <laughs> Anybody else deal with this? Like I can't even get it straight back here to slide it in. <laughs> There's no way I can push on this. to make it go in. Pulled a muscle in my dang leg. Huh. I don't know, man. <sighs> I don't know what to do. So, now we got a hammer. Let's see if this works any better. Well, at least it's back in there anyway. Ugh, what a freaking mess that was.